Hey lovely people, we must tell you that this episode is the finale of our series on YouTube, but this is not the end of our story. Our journey continues on the Pocket FM app. Install it now for the complete audio series. Let us continue this journey together on the app. Open the door, we know Emma's inside. Come out Emma, your game's over. Get out right now or we will break the store. My doors can't hold them much longer. I'm scared. Don't worry. We are safe here. Where the heck is Luke? They're coming, Eric. What should we do? I will go out and buy us some time. No! Don't leave me alone! Emma, you hide here until I come back. Listen, you're gonna be okay. I'm not gonna let anyone harm you. Love you. Hey, that's him from the photo shoot! Where's Emma? Listen to me. She is not... She must be inside. No! Wait! Already been two hours. Where the hell's Brad? Brad and his assistant, Freddy. They are both unreachable. I tried everything. Brad, the most popular face in the country, had been roped in for the much-anticipated wedding photo shoot with Emma. But after Emma stood him up at dinner, Brad decided to get back at her. What an entitled star kid! Thinks he's bigger than the industry. Replace him! It's impossible to find someone in such a short time. Plus, the shoot's with Emma. Well... There is someone. As big as Brad? Even bigger. Who is it? Will he agree on such a short notice? He's just a call away. But there's one condition. You can't reveal his identity. Not to your crew and definitely not in the photo shoot. Done. Call him in. We start in an hour. Another round, please. Jackson has been calling nonstop. They're waiting for us. So what? Make them wait a little longer. No one messes with the superstar, Brad. Brad, this is also a big shoot for us. We should go. Relax, man. They need me. I don't. Remember, I am Brad. And she's Emma. You know what? You're right. Let's go. Let me show her who's the boss. Emma, the boss is here. I am so nervous. Emma was elated for the shoot. She had butterflies in her stomach as she walked out in her long blue chiffon dress, making a grand entry. That's impossible. <gasps> Mr. Ro Roberts, what a pleasant surprise. I am the director, David. Heard someone needed my help. Mr. Roberts. Emma, you look stunning. I really wasn't sure you would come. Why wouldn't I? I made you a promise. Sir, uh, Emma, um, uh, we are ready. And so are we. Okay, so, Mr. Roberts, you have to walk down the aisle and... Uh-huh. Don't bother. I know exactly what to do. Of course! Roll sound! Action! To everyone's surprise, and especially Emma's, Eric improvised the proposal scene with such finesse that it turned out better than David's expectations. Eric walked down to Emma, holding her favorite daisies, and went down on his knees, just like he had promised Emma. Emma got emotional as he took out the wedding ring. Will you marry me? Yes. Yes, I will. And cut! Cut this crap! Don't care what the damn media says! That cheap model Emma stood me up! What does she think of herself? Remember, you need this assignment. I am going to make Emma bow down to me. We are here! Whatever happens, let me do the talking. Huh. Looks like they have canceled the shoot. Hey, Jackson! Brad is here! Sorry, we were busy with another shoot! Yeah, you know how busy I am. But I got this. We don't have to cancel. Brad, things have changed. The shoot was never canceled, it just got over. What do you mean? I am the lead star! Yeah, but you refused, so we went ahead without you. <laughs> do you even know who I am? It was Emma. She called in the replacement. How dare she? Who could you possibly replace Brad with? You don't want to know. Trust me. That's it. You've messed with the wrong person. The war's on, Emma. Count your final days now. The photos have come out really well, Emma. Honestly, there wasn't much acting to do. 
Well, well, you guys have really created a buzz online. Brad's not gonna let this go so easily. You're in for trouble. Let him come. I can handle such guys. Brad is different, Emma. You have really hurt his ego. Emma, we gotta go. Brad's fans have surrounded the building and they're pissed. Emma, you coward! You messed with Brad! Show us your face now! We will burn the building down. Emma, you better apologize to Brad. Apologize? There is no way Emma's gonna bow down to that scoundrel. You can't deal with Brad and his father. Emma, take the back door and leave immediately for Tribeca. You will be safe there. I will deal with Brad here. I will come with you. No, you stay here with Richard. Richard, this is all your fault. You are so irresponsible. How is it my fault? If they wanted to replace Brad, you should have stayed out of it. Why would you recommend them, Mr. Roberts? Seriously? First Moscow, then today, Charlotte? Emma is going through such a difficult time. I don't understand. When will you actually start protecting your artists? Watch your tone. You created this mess. I am not cleaning it up for you. So you're going to just hand over Emma to Brad? You are done here, Richard. Looks like they are having a meeting without me, Freddy. Lower your gun, Brad. We don't want any trouble. You know it wasn't Emma's fault. Oh, it must be my fault then. Do you want to tell those people the truth? Brad, please. Emma's not here. That means you know where she is right now. No, we don't. Brad, look at those photos. Well, well, well. So Mr. Eric Roberts had the nerve to replace me. Not gonna lie, they do look good together. He will rip you into pieces. <laughs> Did you hear that, Freddy? Do they know that my father made Eric what he is today? Emma must be there. I know where Eric lives. Problem solved. No! Brad, open the door. Emma, please, Emma, pick up. She left her phone here. I have to go to Tribeca myself. Charlotte, I'm going to need your pistol. You're back early. Nice. Thought we could go on a nice trip. There's chaos out there. What's wrong? You're sweating. Brad has gone berserk. His fans have mobbed Charlotte's office. He wants me bad. Sit down. I know Brad. I'm sure he won't harm you. No, I have seen it in his eyes. He wants revenge. Don't worry. They can't get here. Let me call Luke, just in case. Let's lay low for a few days. Don't have a good feeling about this. We should leave. Let's hide inside. Open the door. We know she's in there. Come out, Emma. Your game is over. Get out right now, or we will break the store. She is definitely in there, boys. I want her unharmed. Do what it takes. Get me them. Get out, Emma. Your time's up. Brad, you're gonna pay for this. You don't know who you're messing with. No, no, Eric, don't leave me alone. Emma, you stay hidden until I come back. I love you. Hey, that's him from the photo shoot. Where's Emma? I am here. You better talk to me before it's too late. Are you threatening me? Warning you. Don't mess with Emma if you want to survive in this industry. I am gonna destroy you, Eric. You can't destroy a storm, Brad. You're free to try. Looks like you are in for some adventure. <laughs> Everyone in the room froze. Emma feared the worst from inside the room. Eric held his chest, but to everyone's disbelief, Brad fell on his knees grunting in pain. Behind him stood Richard, firing a shot from his pistol. Mr. Roberts, make sure Emma is safe. I will handle this. Emma, hurry, we need to... Emma? Emma! Eric is stunned to find Emma missing from the room. Looks like Brad's angry mob got to her after all. Or did she manage to escape? Dear all, this is the finale of our series on YouTube. But this is not the end of our story. Further episodes are available only on the Pocket FM app. Install it now for the complete audio series. Just click the link in the description. Hope to see you all as we continue our journey on the app. Love you!